Let's kiss your Kamal the Honourable Member for Nunavut. Privacy rights are, are fundamental. Uh, small businesses are important. And I wonder if the member agrees that it's important to empower the uh, privacy commissioner to uh, enforce the protection of both those groups of people. The Honourable Member for Haldeman Norfolk. Thank my, I thank the member for the question. And I, I do want to say that I am impressed that Bill C-27 does give the Privacy Commissioner some teeth to enforce penalties. So that I, I acknowledge. And I'm, I also see it as a positive that there is some attempt to create some sort of regulatory framework, but it does not go far enough. This framework has to start from the federal government and work its way down so that we have an umbrella legislation as to protect the digital privacy of Canadians. Questions and comments? Kestiyan Kamal Tara, the Honourable Member for Pickering Uxbridge. Mr. Speaker, thank you for the opportunity to ask this Honourable Member a question. I'm just curious if she thinks there should be consequences or uh, or retromand for members of this House who meet with known Nazis who spread uh, misinformation, disinformation, glorify the Holocaust, who speak against uh, uh, anti-Muslim rhetoric. Uh, I'm just curious if she's talking about online hate and privacy of Canadians and regulation. Does she condemn her actions by meeting with a known Nazi uh, in this country who spout anti-Muslim rhetoric? The Honourable Member for Haldeman Norfolk. This Prime Minister has met with far worse individuals than I have ever met with. And I can tell you one thing, that a Member of Parliament, as a Member of Parliament, it is my duty to have me... I believe I have a point of order, the, the Honourable Parliamentary Secretary. Yes, uh, uh, Ms, M M Mr. Speaker, all members are honourable members. The member just said that the Prime Minister has met with uh, worse people than she has. I'd like her to name them. That is demanding into debate here as well. Uh, the Honourable Member for Haldeman Norfolk, from the top. The Prime Minister has put on blackface so many times. He has degraded black people. He literally put a banana in his pants. And you have the audacity, you have the audacity to stand and look at me as a black woman and ask about my meeting with another member of the European Parliament. That is within my job description. I do not have to, I do not have to approve of everything that another member believes in in order to have the decency to have meetings with, with other individuals. Your Prime Minister, this Prime Minister, denigrated black men by putting a banana in his pants. Shame on every member over there that does not chastise them. If this were any other country, he would not be leading, and he would not have the moral authority to lead. He would not have that moral authority. Continuing debate, uh, the Honourable Member for Abbotsford. Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker. And to bring it back to the topic of this debate is Bill C-27. And the intention of this bill, of course, was to modernize the protection of digital privacy rights here in Canada. 